treatment options in the atrophied maxilla are bone grafting, sinus lift, zygomatic implants, and now we have another alternative. We may treat the atrophied maxilla and the atrophied mandible by the principles of cortically fixed. What does it mean? Now, in the maxilla, as well in the mandible, we have cortical areas. We have the tergit plate, we have the zygomatic arch, we have the premaxilla, and we have the retromandibular region. So, the invention was to develop a specific type of fixation and I had the chance that a company based in Switzerland developed with me the ideas to develop four different plates, which I call hybrid plates, because they manage in one way one part of an implant, which is a head, and one part of the fixation used in maxillofacial surgery, like here. And we may fix these hybrid plates everywhere on the maxilla and in the mandible there with cortical bone. The specificity of these plates is that they are hardly flexible and they may be adapted to all bone conditions and they are fixed with osteosynthesis screws. The big challenge is to do then all the atrophies and the uh, mandibles by immediate loading, which allow to shorten all procedures. Actually, patients, when they have a problem, when they are teethless, they want fix teeth. And they are happy to have this in a very short time. The mentioned surgeries like nerve displacement or bone grafting or zygomatic implants, which are quite invasive, take time and cost money. By these principles to use the cortical areas or the cortical fixed advanced technique, we may help patients in a very short time due to the specific surgery and the specific implants used. And I'm very honored to announce that I can give another time training and courses at the King's College in London to train colleagues all over the world by this technique. The course will be held from 14th to 16th of October. And please feel free to go on the website which is www.corticallyfixed.com